Hello guys, welcome to Techo Friendly. So today uh, in this video, I'm going to show you uh, how to uh, so fix uh, the issue uh, which is called uh, which is called as uh, xlive dot dll is mix, uh, missing from your system. So uh, this uh, issue occurs often to uh, uh, many uh, guys. Uh, that uh, when whenever you start a particular game or a program, uh, a pop-up or a dialog box pops up saying that uh, xlive.dll is missing from your system. For example, when I uh, start this uh, game uh, called as Batman Arkham City, so it, uh, you as you can see that uh, a uh, dialog box uh, had uh, popped up. Uh, saying that the program can't start because xlive.dll is missing from your computer try reinstalling the program to fix this problem so it is not uh, this has no, has nothing to do with your program or that uh, particular application the problem is that uh, a dll file is missing uh, or is not there in your system so the fix is also uh, pretty simple so uh, just follow me First of all, open your uh, Chrome browser and type in xlive.dll and then click enter. Go to the first link that appears on the uh, screen, click it and go to the site. So uh, now uh, here you can see many options. Uh, uh, redirecting you to uh, download this uh, DLL so the first link or the first option says that uh, uh, lifetime license and uh, full support guaranteed uh, uh, this is a premium uh, version or a premium uh, way uh, to download it so we don't need any of these scroll down and go to the uh, xlive.dll uh, these options you can see uh, which is showing uh, different versions and size uh, where you uh, also showing a download key here so uh, go for the latest version whichever it is on the list and click download so guys uh, i had downloaded it already so let's skip the downloading part and I extract then extract it so something like this will come just now what you have to do is just copy this file and paste it in go to your windows local disk go to windows folder then look for a folder called as system32 go to search bar and type system system32 okay here it is go to that folder and paste it here continue okay so i have pasted this now this pretty much uh, solves the issue in many cases but there are times when uh, this won't work so you have to do one more step uh, go to if folder called as system sys wow64 okay you can see it on the screen go to this folder and paste it here too so continue so what this does is guys uh, these two folders uh, contains the dll files that load that your system loads whenever you are uh, running a particular program or uh, a game uh, it checks and loads whatever the game and uh, uh, the program is asking the system to load so this this folder contains all the 32 bit uh, dlls and this one contains 64 bit dlls so uh, it depends over the program or the game whichever it requires so it's better to copy in both these folders so now just let us try opening it so yeah the problem is fixed there is no uh, dialog box the game will start in a bit so guys um, uh, that was it 
in this way you can uh, fix this issue uh, in any program or in any game so guys if you like my video uh, just uh, give me a thumbs up or if you have any doubt or any uh, misconceptions regarding the installation uh, it's pretty much simple uh, still if you have any problems or any doubts just uh, feel free to share it, uh, it down in the comment section so uh, um, see you in uh, my next tutorial video till then bye